Hi everyone, my name is Heather and I'm the person behind Happy Puppy Truffles. Today I wanted to share with you guys the next in my sort of series of seven really cool traditional Japanese fashion goods that you can get at Daiso. And they usually range between 100 yen to uh, 200 yen or 150 yen depending on what they are. And I shared with you a really cute uh, hair clip uh, the, uh, the other day and I wanted to show you guys another one too. This is just so pretty and is a classic style kind of thing. Real easy, just the kind of you know, simple pinch clip that you can put on. And the, the design on it is so pretty. There are a lot of these kinds of, this technique of putting the uh, fabric to make flowers and stuff. And the thing is that these kinds of clips usually are ridiculously overpriced. And uh, this whole new series that they have at Daiso right now, this Kubashi series here, um, was something I hadn't really seen before. Um, and last last summer when my daughter wore a kimono to her, I mean a yukata, a summer kimono to her festival, you know, she wanted to put her hair up all pretty and wanted one of these really fancy pens, kind of like this, the one I, I had made for her actually had like little flowers cascading down. But that kind of a clip normally would be $20. But um, so, you know, that's why I chose to make mine. But I think this kind of a thing, you know, it's 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 made and it's cute and it's 100 yen. I mean, it's perfect. A uh, real common kind of thing to put, like I say, if people get dressed up in yukata or kimono, they usually wear their hair up, of course, and they accessorize their hair with lots of variations of clips, different ones. And the funny thing is that always kind of is weird to me because I'm really big on matching everything. They don't match stuff. They don't try to match stuff. So even though your kimono might be all red, you'd wear a pin like this. Or the pattern of your kimono might be completely different than the pattern of the fabric here. But they don't care about that. It's just all about, you know, the overall finished appearance of everything. So for me, it was a little weird. I was like, what? Why does that not match? <laughs> Maybe the really, really high class people do match. I don't know. But <laughs> for all us local people, that's what we do. We go with what you get. So, so I think that getting something like this is just so cute. It's just perfect. Here, I'll take it out so you guys can see it without the glare. But um, it's got the little cute little halved um, have kind of pearl there in the middle. And the pieces, it's truly like kind of like origami fabric, you know, to, to make these. And there's a whole art to that. And it's beautiful. But it's just really well made with a little bit of felt in the back and you don't see any like weird obscene pieces of like glue sticking everywhere because sometimes if you buy these really cheap somewhere that's how they are so the quality i thought was pretty good so definitely something that makes such a great gift if you are uh, looking for something fun to bring home with you after visiting uh you know this is something that would be such a nice gift for people and still looks like it's like really nice so yeah, wanted to share this one as I show you guys a whole series of things from, from this whole kind of group of stuff that they have now at Daiso. So, And I never know how much or how soon and all of what we have here makes it way to the stores that are in other countries, you know. So I, I don't know, it'd be interesting to see, you know, if this kind of a thing is available or not. So something to look out for. Um, I have some more in the series, so look for those, you guys. Uh, thanks again always so much for watching, and I'll see you all next time. Bye!